I'm gonna talk about foundation choice and how to choose the right one for your skin type and your personal needs. I'm gonna start with BB Cream. This is our complexion enhancer. It's basically like a tinted moisturizer. So I just need a little bit of our BB Cream and I'm just gonna dab it all over. Now the BB Cream is creamy. It is a little bit heavier than a liquid foundation. Um, again, because it is more of a moisturizer than really a foundation. It gives a light coverage and it has a dewy finish um, by itself. So some people choose to use this with a powder on top. Our next option is our pressed powder foundation. Um, and it comes in a compact like this. It comes also with an applicator sponge, so just a little bit goes a long way. And I'm only gonna do half on top of that BB cream so you can see the difference in the finish. So it's just gonna give you a softer powdery finish. Now, this is awesome by itself. It actually gives great coverage. Um, now, if you have dry skin, I would not recommend using just powder. It'll make you feel dry. You can see I did this half of my face, just the cheek area and half of my nose, with just powder. And look at that nice satin finish it gives, and it does give really good coverage. The third foundation option we have is cream foundation, and it also comes in a compact. So I would not recommend this for you if you have oily skin. Um, it is a heavier cream, but it does give fairly good coverage. go back to the powder this time I will use our powder puff brush just dab it in get the excess off you always want to stipple your powder when you're using a blush a brush stipple it on and then brush the excess off All right now last but definitely not least mineral touch liquid foundation this is a, cre or a liquid to powder finish. Again, you can use your fingers, you can use a makeup sponge. I'm going to use our blusher brush to apply this today. For my chin, one drop is gonna be more than enough. If I was doing my whole face, four to five drops is plenty. My blemishes are gone. And this is going to dry to a powder finish. There's no need to apply powder on top of it. If you guys have any questions or you need help matching the proper shade for your skin tone, please let me know. I'm here to help. Have a great day. Bye.